Anambra State has officially joined oil producing states in Nigeria following an approval granted by the Revenue Mobilization Allocation and Fiscal Commission RMAFC, which has ratified the attribution of 11 oil wells in the states. With the approval, the southeastern state is expected to henceforth be eligible to benefit from the 13% derivation fund, which mineral producing states in Nigeria are statutory entitled to. For the state, it has been a long drawn out battle to be recognized as an oil producing state, but with the Department of Petroleum Resources DPR insisting for years that the state has not met all the precautions and preconditions to be added to the list. Two years ago, the DPR, when confronted by the Senate on why the state had not been recognized, insisted that Anambra, Enugu, and Kogi state could not be declared oil producing states until the company prospecting for the commodity scaled up its operations from an oil you know from an oil prospecting to oil mining lease but in the approval which was contained in a letter signed by the secretary to the RMAFC Mr Mohammed Shiu and dated August 24, 2021, the Commission stated that Anambra will be eligible for the 13% derivation found immediately it begins to contribute to the federal account. Addressed to Governor of Anambra State, Mr. Willie Obiano, the letter with reference RMC slash O and G slash forty eight slash volume slash one slash fifty five stated that the decision to designate the states and oil producing states was taken at the RMA FC's one hundred and thirty ninth plenary section held on twenty seventh july twenty twenty one. In addition, the Revenue Mobilization Body also approved the attribution of Anambra River 1, 2, and 3 oil wells to be shared on the 50% basis between Anambra and Kogi State, pending the final delineation of boundaries between the two states. I wish to refer to your letter dated. 24th March 2021 on the above subjects and to inform you that the commission at its 139th plenary section held on 27th July 2021 approved the attribution of the following oil wells to Anambra State. Unzam 1 Oil Well Alo 1 Oil Well Obu 1 Oil Well Amashi 1, 2, 3, and 4 oil wells. Enyi 1, 2, 3, and 4 oil wells. Furthermore, the Commission also approved the attribution of Anambra River 1, 2, and 3 oil wells on O50 ratio 50 percentage basis between Anambra and Kogi states pending the final delineation of the boundary between the two states according accordingly pardon a number of states will start to benefit from the 13 percent derivation fund as soon as proceeds from the operation in the above the named oil wells start contributing revenue into the federation's account the federal agency stretched with the inclusion Anambra has now joined the league of 10 other oil producing states 
that are statutorily entitled to the derivation found. Akwaibom, Rivers, Delta, Bayelsa, Ondo, Edo, Imo, Abia, and Lagos State are the other subnationals in the country which have crude oil in their areas. What is your thought about this? What is your own reaction to this plain situation of things? We would like you to drop your thoughts and reaction via the comment section on this that has been said. As we can see, finally, Anambra has now joined the League of Oil Producing States. Anambra State successfully and officially joined the oil producing states in Nigeria following an approval granted by the Revenue Mobilization Allocation and Fiscal Commission, which has ratified the attribution of 11 oil wells in the state. We would like you to drop your thoughts on this present situation. We would like you to drop your own reaction via the comment section on this that has been said. But before we go, let's people's reactions and know their thoughts about this. Let's see what people have felt concerning the present situation of things in Nigeria. Jonathan Oshayiri reacted to this and said, This is a very useless country. Total percent of oil proceeds has been approved by Buhari for the searching of elusive oil in northern Nigeria while mining of already discovered oil in a core Igbo state of Anambra has been delayed for more than 40 years. Anambra has been deliberately manipulated by Nigerian states and deprived of this huge revenue which should have been judiciously, you know, judiciously used pardon, to better the life of lots of people. What is your thought about this? So, what do you think could have caused the long delay of this that has been said by Jonathan? That it was delayed for more than 40 years. The Anambra State has deliberately manipulated, you know, have been deliberately manipulated by the Nigerian government because of this huge revenue the huge revenue that ought to have been used judiciously to better the life of many people what is your thought about this you know sometimes it has been said that the ebos does not have oil but as we can see anambra state has now joined the lake of oil producing states what is your thought about this it's overdue but let's see if we get change in the road work that was a reaction from someone does not want his name to be mentioned he said is overdue but let's see if we get changed in the road work what is your thought about this i would like you to drop your thought and reaction via the comment section on this don't forget that finally anabra state has now joined the league of oil producing states in this country anabra now has a oil producing you know anabra has now finally become an oil producing state in nigeria what is your thought about this? What is your own reaction to this? What will you say concerning the Anambra state that has now finally joined the all prison state of which people have been saying in the comment section that it's long overdue? But let's see if there will be a positive change at the long run. People have said the Anambra state have been deliberately manipulated by the Nigerian states and deprived of this their huge revenue for over 40 years.